What is up guys, Monster Gen Fanatic here. I'm going to Monsters on the Beach today, but I wanted to make a little uh, stop, pit stop to this, I guess, collectible store. The whole upstairs is a toy shop. The bottom uh, floor is like antiques and um, came in and immediately saw that. So <laughs> uh, I know I was in for something crazy. Um, I came here like uh, over a year ago. They didn't have too many monster trucks, but that has definitely changed today. Wow, look at all these Spin Masters, guys. I haven't really looked through. I just saw like stuff on the front and I was like, well, I gotta record this. They even have some old loose ones. It's had to have been a whole collection for someone, but there's also new stuff here. I'm, I don't need too many trucks from Spin Master. They have Mix 18 Higher Education and Dragonoid that I may pick that up. Yeah, they have some cool stuff though. Even a small hub backdrop, I do have that. I don't think it is $12.98. I really hope not. It's $8, which isn't isn't too bad. We're a little reasonable, but we'll go through here and take a quick look at some of these trucks. I do have most of these. The Bigfoot Ride truck back there. I don't know if you guys can see that. Um, they have some brand new stuff as well, which is crazy. They have the Beetle. They have that Recreational. That Bigfoot, which I believe is kind of rare. I'm not really sure though. I have it, so as when I get stuff, I really don't pay attention if it's rare or not, because as long as I have it, it's fine. I, I think I have that Roger Dodger. Um, speaking of Roger Dodger, here is a treasure hunt. It doesn't say how much it is. Oh, well, $5 for a treasure hunt. Definitely gonna pick that up. I don't even have that. Um, I don't see any other stuff. There's a Devastator Mud Shreds, but that's just the tip of the iceberg for the other stuff that they have here. I also wanna show you a couple of loose trucks they have up here, because I actually do need this backdraft. These are mostly $3, so reasonable price too. We have Hot Wheels, Test Subject, Shock Therapy, Batman, Donut Patrol. I do need this as well. Wow, guys, I'm almost shaking. I've never seen anything like this. Clydesdale, it's a Dirt Treads Maximum Destruction. I have that, but it's in bad condition. Um, I'm getting that Thrasher from Mac Mola Mac. I made a stupid custom out of mine. Um, I think I need that, actually. I don't know how I didn't see that. Uh, I don't really see anything else, but that's not even all, guys. Check this out. Got some Hot Wheels, too. I collect those, so I may look through that as well. But um, check this out. We have some more in um bags loose monster trucks i guess There's some newer trucks up there captain's curse hot wheels gold i do need that pouncer but i have to take these three off first to get the pouncer here this is a, like a 2004 grave digger i already have that i do need this one though so probably gonna pick that up look at this this even comes with the accessory that tire thing that's insane this is definitely overwhelming oh wow there's a spectra flame max d I'm gonna pick that up i do need that picked out several so far let's keep looking we even have some spin masters here um team hot wheels aftershock we have this american dream i actually do need this i'll put that down too zombie hunter grave digger gunslinger there's that older gunslinger actually i do think i need that i guess i'll pull that out too truly overwhelming seeing something like this guys i've never seen anything like this x racers airborne ranger okay then definitely need that i don't have a hot wheels with the orange wheels so put that in the pile as well i guess shock therapy utter madness which is the smaller cal variant screaming demon honestly i'm i think i might as well oh, no this one's dry rotted too the roll cage that's why i need another screaming demon because my roll cage the roll cage on mine is dry rotted but i'll leave that one there since that one's no better uh, there's another one also the same thing uh, there's a chrome grave digger i'm not gonna look at that i think i'm getting that from my friend let's see what we got oh my this is a a five pack exclusive pure muscle i need that for sure i don't really get the five pack exclusives i don't pay 20 dollars for one truck um cyborg i recently got that skeleton crew wrecking crew uh, team hot wheels and then there's that 2010 medusa that's a good truck uh full bore i recently got that i kind of need that cyborg mine is all messed up but i may pass edge goal shocker brutus color treads grave digger do need that sudden impact uh, mechanical mischief x-ray and grinder okay so we got those i'll put these up oh, wait we got a world finals avenger got some other hot wheels monster trucks um i'll leave those right there since i'm coming right back we got some more over here maximum destruction el toro i have all of these Pony Express. Let's take a look at the Hot Wheels Monster Jam, Radical Rescue, King Crunch Thrasher, a couple more Hot Wheels Monster Trucks. I have all those, but we'll double check just to make sure. A couple Hot Wheels. There's that Invader, NEA, Team Hot Wheels, Wonder Woman. Yeah, that's basically all for here. Got some 124s. I wonder how much this is. I wouldn't mind getting some. 
They're $20, so I'm going to pass. And then there's some more stuff over here. I don't see any Monster Jam uh, related stuff. There's someone over here, but I will show you a little peek of some more Spin Masters that are right here. Dragonoid I need, I do need that. Let's see, $8 for sure taking it. Oh, we can see from the side, Thrasher. Poodle. Son of a digger. That's like an error. There's some more down here. I have all those, tough enough. 30th Grave Digger, Son of a Digger. Bro Camino, Batman. All right, I got everything else. Take this Dragonoid. From what I see, that is all that I need. They even have some two packs here, that is insane. Um, actually, I do need that. If it's not too expensive, I may get it. There's even some monster trucks in those bins. I'll take a look at those off camera. These are $10, bro. Um, I was thinking it was going to be like 15 or 20 I think I may need to pick those up. This is truly overwhelming. Oh, that, that is a Big Hub Sergeant Smash. I do need the Big Hub Sergeant Smash. I don't know if you guys saw that in the back. If you didn't, you'll see it in just a second. Let me get these off. Pure Adrenaline. Of course, it's the very last one though. Oh, it has a missing piece on it. I mean, $3, I'll probably still take it. We have all those. I'll put them back to make it look a little more even. Gotta clean up. There's one thing I was looking at over here. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get. There's Red Shreds, Blue Thunder. Um, We have a hauler over there. I don't know how much that is. I'll take a look at that in a minute when I find someone that works here. Yeah, I'll take a look at what's in here off camera. I mean, just off the bat, I see a small hub, so I'll look real quick, but I think the monster trucks will be on the top since those are bigger, but We'll see. All right, I got a little basket here. We'll go back home and see what we got. I got at least 20 trucks today. Well guys, it's not every day you get a bag full of monster trucks, old and new from a thrift shop. That was the craziest store I've ever been to. I'm finally home. It was about two and a half hours away. I went to the Monsters on the Beach show and just five minutes away from that show was this shop. And I went to it last year and they literally only had a few small hubs in a little uh, bin. And this time they had a whole collection there of trucks. So we're gonna take all of these out and uh, take a look at them. I will open this treasure hunt because why not? I guess we'll start off with the stuff in package. So I guess we'll start off with Dragonoid. So I got this because I, I have not seen Mix 18 since August of last year. I'm only missing two trucks from Mix 18. I'm only missing three trucks in general from 2021. I mean, that is two trucks from this mix, the, uh, the Dragonoid, which now I have. So now I only need two, which is higher education and somehow the Mix 20 Grandma Grave Digger. I got all the chase pieces and everything. Somehow I just have not been able to find those. So here is the Dragonoid. Check this out. Let's just take it out of the package and I'll show you the difference between this one and the original Mix 5 Dragonoid that we got. All right, so we have one of these wheelie bars. This will be one of the last ones I will ever get since I only need a couple more trucks. So the difference between this one um, from the last one is that it has the name Camden Murphy on it, but I don't even seem to find it. But I, you know, I collect all the variants. It says Dragonoid right there. Honestly, I was told that Ken Murphy, uh, Murphy's name on it. And that's really why I got it. We have the Mix 18 Dragonoid right there. We'll take a look at this Dirty to Clean pack real quick. Here it is, El Toro Loco and Higher Education. These were only $10, so I couldn't pass it up. It feels like 15 or 20, which is what I was expecting it to be. I would not have got it, but all those two packs that you saw there were only like $10 each, maybe 12. At least all the ones I saw were $10. So here is the Higher Education. It's almost, it almost looks dirty. I mean, I know it's dirty to clean, but there was actual dirt on the top at first. I don't know. Here it is, brown chassis, black roll cage, black rims, black tires, all blacked out. It actually looks pretty sleek, not gonna lie. Um, I don't even see a lot of dirt on it, but it is pretty warm in my room, so that probably explains why there's no dirt on these trucks. Goes to show you how hot it is in my room right now. There's currently a fan and blasting me right now making it feel a little better in here so here is el toro loco yellow again no mud at all but i think it looks better like that anyway same brown roll cage that higher uh or chassis that higher education has and then we have the treasure hunt that was five dollars where's the price tag boom right there five dollars insane so we'll take this out i feel like the, this place was hit from by another collector it looked pretty fresh there I, I couldn't tell if they actually get trucks in or if it was from a collector but this was on the front of the peg and just chilling there for five dollars i feel like someone would have stole that but here's my first hot wheels monster treasure hunt believe it or not don't have the barbie the shuttle bus snake bite um there's a dairy delivery truck out now don't have any of them this is my first one let's take it out of the package 
check this beauty out now let's look for the treasure hunt logo it is right there on the front side fender right there we have the big engine coming out it, it's this beautiful purple truck it almost switches a shade of purple if you look at it in a certain direction it's a brighter purple i love that color on it and then we have some nice flames going from the hood ending on the back right there um and then we have the red lines on the tires which um goes to show you what uh the treasure hunts look like um they will have the red lines around the uh, tires i think samson has one too the new samson monster truck but i don't know if that's a treasure hunt or not actually i do think it is so that's just gonna make it even harder to find i guess and now for the bags i'm just gonna pull these out randomly i feel like i should have got oh wait never mind they just come right out i was about to say i feel like i should have got scissors but i didn't know they come right out so here's the first one all these trucks i did need some of them may have a little paint chipping um this one actually has some bubbling but honestly it does not matter it's going to be a shelf piece obviously any anyway i love the paint on this the tires aren't too wobbly that one's a little wobbly but it doesn't really matter they're not like locked up so i'll let it slide but um the paint is a little weird but again i love this spectra flame paint oh my god it looks almost gold beautiful truck i've been wanting this truck forever finally got it i got a few spectra flames um today for the next one oh we're coming out with a 2004 or a 2005 backdraft metal base i know they made a smaller version of this which i have and i thought that's what this was and they actually did have a small hub version of this in package there for only like seven dollars but i already had it so i left it for someone who may actually need it but check out this big hub backdraft we got the package here here it is metal base like i said let's see if this is for, yep this is from 04 um check this thing out so again they made this exact one in uh small hub form so this is the one with the big hub tires love the red uh rims but um very sleek looking back uh backdrop i think i have every single backdrop now i'm not completely sure but there is that backdrop now let's take a look at the next one this is a truck i completely needed did not have any variants of this truck i mean there's only one variant and it is american dream let's take this the little bag here it makes it very convenient all these were three dollars a piece so like i could not pass it up um the wheels aren't too wobbly the backs are a little messed up i'll fix that which i basically just did actually so here is the oh my gosh it is a tilt off uh american dream i just noticed that check that out that is awesome i did not even know that's a little surprise to me and by the way oh there's a little water damage in the wheel right there it's all good and if you guys did not know um i'm recording this sunday night i went to the show i went i went to the store friday evening so it's it's been a couple days they've been just chilling in the bag very excited to review these look at the the roll cage that is awesome so here's the american dream so i guess i don't have the normal american dream but i have the tilt top there's only one paint chip that i see on it which is right there so no big deal right there that is a surprise i love collecting the tilt tops for the next one we have this gunslinger from i think it's 2006 let's take it out of the package I'll tell you a little story a little variant between this gunslinger that you guys may not know um unless you're like you know nerds like i am um but this uh gunslinger wait is this a tilt top too no way oh my gosh it is a tilt top i did not even know that gosh there could have been other tilt tops that i may thought i had there that may actually have been tilt tops and i didn't even notice but yeah this gunslinger is also a tilt top i didn't even know they made um that uh the gunslinger for that series but check that out so this gunslinger is a darker shade of red than the gunslinger i have the one i have is from 2007 it's like a lighter red this one's a deep red and i love that looks awesome so rest in peace got hard sock but i did get the tilt top version of that too that is awesome another surprise to me for the next one we have sudden impact i know they did not make a tilt top version of this but i love this body and i've always wanted this um truck in my collection so let's take it out of the package or bag whatever um check it out i think it's from 2004 or 5 uh this is 5 i thought so this sudden impact it looks like it's in perfect condition um no paint chips i mean but the back wheels are a little wobbly i bet i can fix that right here yep basically fix that right there yeah i'm getting good at that um but this the paint is perfect like i don't even think this thing has any sun fading in the color no discoloration the colors and, and wheels are perfectly shiny this is probably the best condition truck that we have opened up so far beautiful truck next up this is a place exclusive grave digger i think this is the grave digger that came with the show off showdown ramp which obviously i did not have it has a c45 code so that's around 2010 but check this out not a tilt top i should have known that i already knew that but any grave digger with gray rims it's usually a place ex uh, exclusive or a gray chassis that's not facts but i that's just from what i see i also never got a grave digger with this thing on the top the grim right there um other than the grim grave digger that came on the new tool back in like 2016 or whatever so pretty cool a uh, little piece of information for you guys if you guys do not know um i'm interesting about this truck here this is the only hot wheels monster truck that i got in a bag you know i got the treasure hunt but it's the only uh, other one that you'll see and this is a five pack exclusive that goes for about 15 to 20 dollars alone even loose on ebay i saw it and i was like whoa is that a five pack exclusive and it is it's the pure muscle and this beautiful body i love it completely clean i love the two-tone white and orange awesome looking it says pure muscle on the tailgate it also says pure muscle right there in a very small font so you guys can probably not even know like make it out but 
it, it looks bigger right there so you guys can see that very cool looking truck wow S couple surprises so this is a truck i actually did think was a tilt top because believe it or not this is only my second pouncer oh it is a tilt top i swear i looked at it in the box or in the bag and i thought it was completely like connected to the uh, chassis or whatever and you couldn't take it off but um believe it or not guys this is my first ever truck so i did not think this was a tilt top i even looked at it in the store i actually do have the tilt top pouncer but um it, it has a missing uh roll cage and stuff and it's actually metal based this is plastic based so that that means this is an actual like a different variant of the one i have the one i have is pla uh, metal based so that's very awesome but yeah tilt top that is tilt top number three did not even know about any of them that's crazy but for the next one i know this isn't a tilt top we got sergeant smash and uh this one i was on the fence about getting but it's only three dollars but there is one uh flaw with this truck there are two trucks that have a flaw other than that this truck's actually in perfect condition same with sudden impact the wheels and the body is shiny no fading on the color from what i see but if you guys couldn't tell the spare wheel that's usually in the back of these hummer designs uh this one does not have it somehow someone ripped it out i've never seen that i didn't even know that could like happen look at the phase on that so um this is the big hub version this is from 2004 and i have the small hub version that's actually right here um check that out um they're about the same size body wise they're about the same size this one maybe a, a tiny bit bigger but uh yeah that's pretty cool a little bit of information for you guys for the next one we have this hot wheels and i think this is a playset exclusive as well or it may have been in a five pack or something but i'll tell you why i think it's a playset exclusive um, I, just, I just told you guys that grade chassis usually indicates that it's a playset truck or from a uh, playset. And this one also has orange wheels. So I'm going to say it's about 2008 and it doesn't even say to oh it says d31 wow so this is a, a recent one so is that like late 2011 because c is 2010 d is 2011 d31 was the 31st week of 2011 could have been an early 2012 truck but i don't even think they made this truck in 2012 i think they came out with that new team Hollis firestorm body so i guess was a, this was in a maybe a play set in 2011 because i don't remember this coming out in mainline i do have this hot wheels with gold wheels from like 2010 or 9 i don't know but uh, that's pretty cool. Here's another truck that unfortunately it is broken. This is probably the only real L I took other than that um, Sergeant Smash. And it is the only x rays that I found. But unfortunately with this one, it is broken. As you can see right here, it is coming off. Oh, wait, I'm learning to show you guys my bad. It is coming off right there. S nothing super glue can't fix. This is my first, uh, second ever x Racers truck. Uh, my first one was Destroyer. This one is in pretty good condition other than the broken plastic piece right there. Uh, it's the only broken x ray slash x Racers truck I've ever like gotten so um i got pretty lucky with that but unfortunately um this one is broken i will get some super glue and it won't make a difference on my shelf um it won't break or anything for the next spectra flame truck this may actually be the only other one it is the spectra flame max e let's take this out of the package check this thing out um again kind of bubbling in the paint i don't even know how that happens done my trucks have that but the spectra flame paint i guess it's only with, uh spectra flames none of the other trucks have that bubbling in the paint you guys probably can't tell but the texture is uh, kind of ridgy i don't understand it but it is spectra flame and i love that chromish paint on this maximum destruction i only have the mud treads version of this one and then i have like that red max d from 2009 or 8 and then i have the tilt tops metal base from like 2007 this is the final one guys this is a variant i needed this is the lone eagle let's take this out of the package so they made two variants of this if you guys did not know is this a tilt off no it is not um they made uh, a one with a blue roll cage and a orange one and i actually got the one with the blue first not knowing there was a variant apparently that one's a little more rare but i never got the orange one and that's the one you're seeing right now this is a metal base so i'm assuming 2006 or 7 uh four wow this is 2004 so this was the first edition lone eagle because i know they didn't make this in small hub so that's pretty cool so there you go guys those are all the trucks i got Thank Thank you guys for watching this was probably a very long video hope you guys enjoyed this video if you want me to go back to the store um please tell me in the comments below and i'll go and uh, show your support and maybe i will go back in the near future maybe sooner than you think and see if they've added any more trucks so with that said i'll see you guys in the next video please subscribe if you have not uh, already like and comment of course and i'll see you guys next time peace out